No Sudden Move, now streaming on HBO Max, is the 1950s set crime thriller directed by Steven Soderbergh. The movie tells the story of a group of small-time criminals who were hired to steal what they think is a simple document in 1954 Detroit. When the plan goes bad, they're forced to search for who hired them and their real reason as their journey takes them through the race-torn rapidly changing city. The film stars John Hamm, Benicio Del Toro, Don Cheadle, and Brendan Fraser. In 2019 Steven Soderbergh announced his plans to direct the film called Kill Switch, with Josh Brolin, Don Cheadle, and John Cena. By March 2020, John Hamm and Cedric the Entertainer entered negotiations, with Josh Brolin dropping out. Filming was delayed as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic but eventually production started in September of 2020. Detroit is as much of a character as any in the new crime thriller No Sudden Move. Initially, we were going to do a much bigger movie that took place all around the country and ended in Detroit, says screenwriter Ed Solomon. It was like, you know what? Let's just do it all in Detroit. No Sudden Move was one of the first films to resume production during the pandemic, which was challenging at the beginning. Steve Soderbergh paid out of his own pocket for two mobile COVID-19 testing units, because he didn't want to take resources away from the citizens of Detroit. The film has many local crew members and local actors. They were the most challenged because of COVID-19. Those who came in from other cities, were away from their families already and were stuck in a hotel. It was much harder for the locals who couldn't even spend time with their own families while shooting. They couldn't hang out with their friends. As a result of all security measure, production was never shut down by an outbreak, 